Welcome folks, it's me, Sluggo, unflinching leader and esteemed president of the Vortex. Tonight on the Vortex, Mistress Peace Theater with Mistress Malicious presents Tennessee Williams' Wild Women of Wongo. Made on a budget more slender than vampire's waistline by a cast and crew of unknowns who stayed that way, this movie has at least one thing going for it the wild women themselves, who are all quite watchable. And that line was written by the Crimson Executioner, who loves to watch women. Anyway, highlights include the nude swimming scene, the temple dance, the crocodile god, and the cat fight between a couple of Wongo girls. Krim, you really went all out on this one. <clears throat> Why would a great playwright like Tennessee Williams get himself involved with a mess like this? He did it as a lark for the credited director, James Walcott, who was a close friend. And with friends like that, well, you know the rest. And then, after that, stay tuned as we welcome Horror House to the Vortex. This exciting new show from The Land Down Under is a love letter to the classic horror hosting shows of the past with a commitment to original, independently created horror cinema of the future. Our hosts are the blue, childish, troll-like vampire Count Fungula, and the beautiful, devious, and terrifyingly feisty succubus Mistress Bubiana. Our ghoulish hosts guide us through various short features from indie filmmakers across Australia. The variety is enough to keep us entertained between the relentless and sometimes violent banter between Count Fungula and Mr. Spubiana, who pranks Fungi endlessly and is always prepared to dismember or castrate him. Ah, a girl after my own heart. A music video from Darkness Visible, the gothic rock band of Fungi's alter ego, Mr. Black, appears at the end of each episode. Please note... Tonight's show is for adults only. Thank you. See you around the Vortex.